Is it working? Yeah. Oh, hello. Uh, anyway, we're off out again. Uh, John, we're supposed to be talking posh today. Ah. <laughs> you will need to bleep that. Oh. You will. Anyway, well, before... Need to bleep that. A little ladyship. <laughs> there we are. Everyone's friend. Yeah. So we're, we're going in that direction where them fishermen have just set up. <laughs> we weren't worried about them. No, we're not worried about fishermen. But anyway, um, fisher people. I got, um, someone said, said oh, yeah. I keep calling them fisher people, and someone said, are you, being, are you being woke? And I was like, no. I said, yeah, I don't know. Fisherman's friend, it sounds a bit dodgy, doesn't it? <laughs> anyway, we're going to just pause there for a second, and then we'll come back in a minute. No, we've got to give a shit. I can't, Tom. I can't hold. I can't hold this steady. <laughs> we've got to give a big shout out to Sue and John on Narrowboat Mothership. Oh, don't worry. You amazing what we do. You know the the comedy Boeing. I've already had to. I've had to do one already. Can't tell you what he said. <laughs> anyway, these lovely people always help us get back into the mooring when we struggle. Yeah. But they're going to laugh at us now, going under that bridge. Right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we nearly got out of the berth. Doesn't look much easier than that. We'd just like to clear something up from our last video, which hasn't gone out yet, but it will have done by the time this one goes out. When we were talking about subscriber numbers. Although we do welcome, if you want to subscribe, that's brilliant. Oh, Hiya, duckies. Well, we, it, it's not about the subscribers for us, and we, if, if, if anybody hasn't realised already, if, if you've watched the channel, because there are a few people who watch the channel. We're not that fat. We're not in it for well. anything. In fact, quite the opposite. We've, we bought a load of mugs with narrowboat potties on and gave them all away. But we have we've, to say, though, we've realised they were actually not best quality. Well, neither are the ones that people are paying 15 quid for. Yes, I know, but I think if we're going to order again, can we get some better stuff? The other we? thing we've also given away is a brand new GoPro. My fault, I bought it, not hated it. it, gave it away. To, the, to Actually, to the bloke who painted narrowboat potteries, but I had no idea he'd, he'd been watching the videos. And he gave a camera to H. I but we Oh, yeah, I gave, yeah. Yeah, he gave H, yeah. I gave H, uh, but he had a mishap. It fell into the canal. Can't blame him for that. But you have to find one. We will find you another one. Oh, we've got enough cameras floating. We'll sort you out. Floating around, you get it. They don't float. They don't float. But we will never have adverts. We will never ask you to donate for a, a, a litre of diesel. We'll never ask for a coffee. We'll never try and sell you a t-shirt with some crappy logo on it. If you want to watch us, it isn't that we don't want people to watch us, we're, we're not obsessed with the numbers. We'll never ask you to raise money to cremate our dead dog. We'll, we'll never go on radio stations saying, look at us. Yeah, it, 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 uh, there's plenty out there if you want to do that, but we're just here just to have a laugh and video the journey. So that out of the way, this is going to be a really boring video. Hey. Do any of you lot know Ermintrude? She lives down near Church Mitchell. Oh, you be careful. Why are you running off? Oh, be careful, you're going to hurt yourselves. Well, that Ermintrude's got a lot to answer for. I only asked if they knew Ermintrude and they all stampeded. I'll have a word with her. I don't know what's going on. Where we there out. was a time, that's a song ain't it? There was a time we worked out we had 13 hoovers because he kept buying hoovers. Then he got rid of his hoover addiction and then... But, but now, can, can I just clarify, what? we didn't use them all, we're, we're dirty buggers, we never, we never used the, the, <laughs> we never used the hoovers, I just like collecting them. BA, right, so, make sure there's nothing on it, right, so that's what he does wrong. Can't how, imagine what's coming how next. many mobile phones? Oh well, you just break them. In about two years, I think I've gone through six. Right, don't even see that. But 
that's got all the cracks and screen. Right. I have two of these on board at the moment that are broken. But I, what I do is my actual phone uses a hotspot and these just for mucking about. Because what worries me, you know, on the internet, because what worries me is I'm going to drop one in the cut again. Are you actually it. standing in front of the camera? Yes, I'm in the camera. Oh, yeah. But anyway, basically. Well, well, there's the windy holes. That's a nice windy hole if anybody's interested. I break everything, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah. And I pay for it all to be replaced. That's not well, true. That's not true. Camera wise, camera wise, I wouldn't even know where to start counting how many cameras we've got. Thirty as a starting point. It's a bit like me with not only have I broke phones though. I've just realised I've got four tablets. One little one that was rubbish. A bigger one that I broke. Second one that I broke. And then the third one I broke. Oh, that's okay. Whereas I'm on about 20 tablets. And I've got a new one. A day. Yeah, but a different type of tablet. But yeah, basically can anything I, electronic I kill. Can I tell them what we've done? Because tell them anything you want. Well, you read it, anyway. it, it's the middle of May now. And we were out over Easter. And when we got back... Don't point rude. Don't point it rude. Hello, Beryl. Um, when we got back, we had seven letters waiting for us from the hospital. And nine appointments between then so why and November <laughs> so what we've done is we've set up a security camera on our front not on the outside on the inside of the front door so that we can see what post arrives how sad is that we are sad very sad and it's close enough to be able to see because the hospital letters are quite distinct and then if we, if something happens Tom will get on his shopability bike what? So it's gone from a clown bike now to a shopability. Yeah, but Vicky in Australia likes the idea of a shopability bike. I and he's going to shopability ride back and get the car. I want, there's this trolley, um, you know like an old lady's trolley, there's a trolley you can get that also converts into a um, into a bicycle trailer. I, there is some um, YouTubers that have got it because they've got a Brompton as well. Something else you won't buy. Just checking the horn. You I'm won't. not going to call it that. Yeah, no, no, anymore. don't call it. Print, but, but yeah. Sykes Hollow. I want Nobody to, there. Chip Brompton, but somebody won't, won't get me one. No. The thing is, though, if I Santa want Brompton, wouldn't though, fit that in his sack. If I want a Brompton, though, I don't really want to ride What's it. What's the I matter, Ethel? I always think of beauty. I also want a Molten bicycle. Have you seen that? From the 1960s. Same guy that, that dis designed this suspension on the mini. I think my cycling days are over now, so I don't really look at bikes. Yeah, but no, I've won them on the walk. The, the molten is a thing of beauty. Anyway. Have I bored you? Well, everybody's falling asleep, even in your mother. So we don't know how long we're out for, do we? No, you're going to have to bleep this. You, you didn't say anything to me. <laughs> you really have to bleep that. No, I said four coffees. If anyone like me can read lips, four coffees looks rude. Anyway, we'll 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 let you know where we're going when we know where we're going. I mean, obviously, it'll be somewhere on this canal, in that direction, because we've just passed the only wind in all five miles. Oh, Eccles, she's not very happy. She wants to get off and play on the towpath. Anyway, w last time we promised a sensible cruise. We're not prom we're not promising it. We're not making any promises. And I also no, I did promise. I'm never ever ever going to tickle him live on camera. <laughs> we always do it when there's a bridge coming up. No, 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 no. I wet myself. Well, I'm not yeah. shaking you. On that note. Just doing the only lock we're doing today, Church Minchel. Tom's got off and walked down to do the lock. One of the ways I deal with not being very steady on my feet is once I'm on the boat, I try not to get off it because I'm all right when I'm on it. 
but I'm a bit hazardous when I'm getting on and off it. So if there's nobody around like now, I wouldn't dream of going to the lot landing. I just uh, hop, hop it, which you can do because there's no wind. If if it was windy, that would be a different. What's the matter? Kettle of fish. Anyway, should be there in a bit. Just approaching Aqueduct Marina, yeah. and the last time we approached Aqueduct Marina, we waved at a boat. That, was it there? No, Jill. Ah, oh, look at that! Said wave to me, but I won't be in. Now we met up with her later that day, or the day after. But we're not going to wave to you, Jill, because we know you're not there again. However, we're going to wave to our old boat, Mucker, who lives there now. Oh yeah, yeah. Anyway. Jill, on her beautiful boat Desiderata, passed us last night Which on way? her way to Crick. Now I don't know when this will go out, but uh, Jill's Could beautiful boat has been exhibited at Crick. And she was so excited when we saw her last night, so I thought you weren't starting out till tomorrow. She said I couldn't wait. <laughs> She's having a leisurely cruise down to Crick, yeah, so single-handed. So, all the best. Fingers crossed. But one thing I will say about going back to Mucker, Mucker's like a, a new broom, isn't it? Because it's had a whole new paint job, it's had new windows, I think it's having a new interior, I think. Oh, it's had. Yeah, we yeah. could have bought a good decent boat. Too. Yeah, they bought a great boat. I love this field. Anyway, good luck, Jill. I've always said what's good enough for the dog is good enough for me. <laughs> it's been like. Do you remember that a few years ago we were selling um, compressed air? Um, was it air or water in a can? It was air, wasn't it? What got me is on that advert they had a camel and they were spraying it on a camel, but it wasn't going. If you were a camel, <laughs> so it was going like. <laughs> Have you got those ones with the windscreen wipers on? <laughs> we're not being silly today. No, we're but not being, we're not being silly. That wasn't my favourite product. My favourite product was VIP. And uh, oh, and I kept on saying, seen? "Who the hell is going to buy that?" And then, unfortunately, I went your to, sister. I went to my sister's bathroom, and it was there. She's got cupboards full. No, she had two bottles. All right, well, that's cupboards full to me. They were a few pounds, like. And I'm, I mean, I'm saying six whoever seven. sold that idea to somebody, somebody who and it, we won't talk about bowels. We're nearly, we're nearly where we're going. We think, because we don't know where we're going. This is the stretch of canal that there's usually somebody painting a boat. Do you know what I, I do? You know if, I, if I'm at a service station and I need to empty my bowels, I always either cough or sneeze just when it hits the water. So, you know, so that no the, Jap is. the Japanese do that. I go, Achoo! The Japanese toilets make, they, they have music in them. Do they? Because they're embarrassed from the noise. Don't they also have, um, like, wash your bum after? 
Well, I can set a jet wash up. Hang on, I can see something. Oh, I don't know what that is, I better go. This is for the dog, but it's great for John. Uh, oh, pardon me. Beckles? Hi, Eccles. Hello. Ooh. Ooh, doo -doo -doo. That there's, there used to be a bridge. Can you see how it bulges out on that side? I'd love to see somebody get through there without scraping. I'm sure it's possible, but we've never done it. Anyway. What's blacking? What's blacking got to do with it? We're nearly where we're going. It's 10 to 12 on a Saturday, a glorious Saturday by the way, and we've been out, I don't know, anyway we've been out, and we haven't passed one boat on the move in either direction, and we're almost, we're going to the visitor moor in at Church Minchel, and at 2 o'clock there'll be a load of higher boats released from that marina, and there'll be loads of higher boats released from Middlewich. So I reckon by about three, should be wacky races. <laughs> ah, but we'll be moored up by then. Won't we, Ethel? Yes. yes. We've now turned into water wombles. Not a thief? Well, no wombles go around gathering. Well, I don't know, I've never seen them. Show, show the view of what we've just found. If you recognise this. And if you offer your... a reward of £50, because it looks like a brand new one. Mind you, we've, we've used £50 worth of diesel stopping to go back and pick it up. Are you happy now? Has that made your day? Well, the thing is, we never know if we're going to lose it. Well, we've else. lost enough windlasses. Oh, God, do you remember chains. I tried to kill you with that windlass? Yeah, Stoke. By, by the cemetery, funnily enough. <laughs> he dropped it off the bridge. And and it, the, put a the, chunk out of the boat, five glass boat, and hit you. Did it miss your boat? It missed I heard it go whoosh past me and it hit the, and the big piece of fiberglass shot into the canal. Sorry about that. And, and just the other side of the bridge was the cemetery where my grandma is. And I thought he was trying to that, dispatch we me. We went for a walk near the canal there. Right, and, and and some people say it's lovely, but anyway, there was this guy, right? And he kept just, he was just staring at us and I was like to John, let's get out of here. And he kept just sh flicking out a little bit of a knife out of his pocket, showing us he had a knife. And I just stood and like, what's well, that about? Well, see, when I were a lad... We were supposed to be scared of him. There know. were people on bikes all the time with knives. Well, I had all one the time. They used uh, to sharpen we, them. Yeah, they used to sharpen my pen, pencil with it. No, I think no, it no, 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 no. He had a, a bike and he put his front wheel on oh, the stand and he had a sa sanding wheel and yeah. he used to pedal like crazy yeah. okay. and sharpen everybody's knives. But anyway. No, they'd hold you up. No, but. Anyway. See, when I was a lad, we had one for being scouts. Now you get in trouble, aren't you? Water wombles. Oh, yeah, and water wombles. Right, and this is what we're using for Ethel. She's loving it. Yeah, we've done that bit. Tom, I need. To, there's a. I'm bendy, I've it... <laughs> got a new thing to annoy him with, I'm loving it. Yeah, I have. A what? nappy pin. I'm turning off now because there's a tree here. So this will do, won't you, Ethel? <coughs> you, you've just been off. 
No. Wake everybody up. 